Right there, the snow should be falling within a matter of hours, and the state, of course, has been getting ready all day. And we heard from Governor Lamont this afternoon. Channel 3's Dylan Fearon spoke to him, and he is live in Farmington tonight with the latest. Dylan. Yeah, Mark, Aaron, good evening. Look, we spoke to Governor Lamont, spoke to the Department of Transportation. Everyone's saying this is going to be a long night and a very long day tomorrow, especially for the DOT workers who will be out driving on these roads for as long as 17 to 21 hours, keeping us safe without taking a break. Before the snow comes all the salt, loading and pre-treating. Uh, we're ready to go. Ready for winter storm Anthony. Crews are loading the trucks and checking the equipment. We're going to be up for uh, probably well over 24 hours, um, helping to work to keep our roads clear and safe for all of our travelers. Yeah, ready for late night? Yeah. Governor Lamont stops by a DOT garage in Weathersfield. Connecticut has 920 drivers working tonight or tomorrow. They'll be sharing 600 plows. The state has even named some of them. We have a Plowzilla. We have Scoop Dog. For those with a literary bent, my favorite was Edgar Allan Snow. An important message from the DOT, stay off the roads unless it's absolutely necessary and watch out for the plows. Do not crowd the plow. Uh, too often we see people encroaching upon those plows uh, who are traveling slow to ensure we can clear all the roadways and it creates an unsafe situation for all of us. Local crews are also preparing. Like in Vernon, police will let emergency management officials know when it's time to hit the roads. This is kind of our first time, you know, of the year, so I think everyone wants to make sure that we're doing it right. We'll get through this together. Now, again, the state has 920 drivers working either tonight or tomorrow, but Mark and Aaron were told they're still short about 115 drivers for the rest of the winter, looking for mechanics as well to help fix broken equipment. We'll touch on that tonight at 6. We're live in Farmington. I'm Dylan Fear in Channel 3 Eyewitness News. All right.